Good morning. All right. Come on in here. All right, good morning. Let's get our coffee. Get our coffee going. How's everybody doing on this beautiful Monday? Beautiful Monday. Mm. Yes. Oh, yeah. I heard that. Sun is out. Finally can warm up. Rain is gone. Hey, it was good. It was good. Good. Got my coffee going. Arkansas in the house. Good to see you. Good to see you. A new day. <laughs> I know that's right. Got a brand new day. Wow, hate to hear that, man. Mm. We sure say a prayer for you, Brian. <laughs> hey. Hey, well, I'm back. All right, all right. Yeah, I've been good. Uh, me and little man, we went on vacation. Got away. <laughs> I was having withdrawals to watch videos over and over. <laughs> oh. I must confess... I'm addicted to love. 
Nice to be loved. Yeah. Well, all right, all right. Man, I hope you're going to get all right, Brian. <clears throat> That's the cup. That's the first cup of coffee I've had sugar in all week, all weekend. Wow! So, how you gonna go on vacation? Forget sugar. So I had to drink my coffee all weekend with no sugar in it. <laughs> I mean, I survived, but you know, I couldn't wait to get some sugar. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Well, thank you. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for being sweet, and it's good to see y'all. And I am back, and uh, I owe y'all a concert. And, uh, yeah, so thank y'all for loving. Thank y'all for loving me and my family. Uh, you know, what more could you ask for, you know? <laughs> What's going on, Steeler boy? Yeah, Steeler's boy, yeah. Hey, good morning, good morning. Wow. Hey, Alice, yeah, I see you, girl. Feels good to be loved on it. Oh, yes, it does. Yes, it does. <sighs> Top of the morning to you. Well, thank you. That's very sweet of you. Very sweet of you. So I started, I started my first day off right, like running late. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, ain't nothing like oversleeping, is it? You know? Nothing quite like oversleeping. Uh, it was like a loss in the family. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. <sighs> uh, I went to Ella J. Uh, went to the mountains. Stayed in a stayed in a cabin overlooking uh the mountaintops. It was beautiful. Um Charlotte, we wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> yeah, like we had a good time. So so me and um so me and little man, we went with we went with uh Brian and Cheryl and Adam and Laura. So we uh we all went. They they invited us. Uh they invited me and little man to come to the mountains with them and we done it. So um Wow, it was beautiful. It was beautiful. Um <laughs> They had, it was hot tubs, pool tables, dart boards, spas, saunas. Man, that thing had everything you could ask for. We had a good time. Oh, yeah. Bentley just, Bentley just, yeah, if you was on my Snapchat, didn't you seen some pictures? Because I posted, I don't know, quite a few pictures of the trip, but, uh. If you wasn't on Snapchat, then you didn't see it. That's the most incredible view. Man, it, you know, it reminded me of being, like I know, you, if I compare my yard to the mountains, you'd be like, what? No, but I'm telling you, like, 
that view reminded me of being home, like at my house. There was so much peace and wow, it was it was gorgeous. And you could definitely you could definitely you could feel the presence of the Lord. Like if you ever seen <laughs> Deanne said all those deer. Oh yeah. They was they was like fifteen deer came up to the balcony uh at the lodge and um we fed them bread off the handrails. Yeah, it was a, at least fifteen of them. They ate pizza, they ate they ate bread, hamburger buns, like they they liked it all. I said, Man I said, instead of buying all that corn, uh I said, instead of buying all that corn, we should have just should just been buying bread all this time. <laughs> yeah, they they uh they they was beautiful. Beautiful to oh they ate biscuits too, yeah, don't forget. Yeah. So, so let me tell you, the highlight of the trip, I would have to say, I don't know, we ate ribs, they was good, we ate grilled chicken, barbecue chicken, that was good, but let me tell you, the highlight of the trip, breakfast, let me tell you, we had cheese grits, we had bacon, we had sausage, we had biscuit and gravy, I'm talking about eggs. No pancakes. No pancakes. But we... Uh, did I mention cheese? Did I mention cheese like that? <laughs> I got a little teary eye just thinking about it. And, and like we had that breakfast every morning. Uh, that was really good. What's going on, Ron? Good to see y'all. <laughs> I can tell you this. Brian and Cher said they've ate grits their whole life. They said they never ate grits like that. I was like, yeah, them's, them's, that's like the way a grit's supposed to be. He's like, that was the best grits I've ever had in my whole entire life. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Yeah. Done good. Done good. It's good to see y'all, y'all, this morning. I put sugar in my grits. I hear that. Listen at her now. What's going on? Good to see y'all. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We did. We did do that. But, uh, hey, good morning. That was one of the mornings it was foggy. And, um, <laughs> what's going on? There was one of them mornings it was foggy. Like, I can't describe it, but the fog, like, wrapped around the mountain peaks and, like, went up like a road. I don't, I ain't never seen that before. But it spiraled up, up the peaks. I, I said, wow. Wow, like. That's pretty crazy. I mean, that's just beautiful. Not crazy, but it's beautiful. What's going on? Uh, went to Ella J. Yeah. Yeah. Was in Ella J. Uh, let's see. Went to J. There was some kind of Mexican place we went to. El Rey's. Um. Uh, What was it, Brian?
<laughs> yeah, it, it was it was good though. I tell you this right here, and, uh, it was authentic because uh, when they brought the salsa out for the chips, could I couldn't eat it. I could smell it. Oh, I know that's right. It was called L Rays. L Rays, yeah. Man, that was good now. I'm going to tell you what. That sauce that I got, it try you out, I can tell you that much. I, I didn't want no part of that. I don't want nothing that's going to burn me up later. You know. You got that right. <laughs> the salsa was hot. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, uh, thank you, thank you. So, yeah. Um, Brian actually ordered a... Wow, dealing with bronchitis along with double ear infection. Wow, sorry to hear that. We'll be praying for you, too. Yeah. Yeah, everybody started in on the salsa, but me. I waited. I don't... Look, if I go to Mexican place... I don't dig into the sauce until I got something to drink. Because, like, I done been there, done that, and had to go to the sink in the bathroom. I don't do that anymore. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. A beautiful, it's a beautiful morning. I love it hot. Well, Yankee Daddy, you'd have been in hog heaven, I can tell you right here. Uh, <laughs> I'm telling you, like, hey, yeah, like, Brian and Adam, like, love hot stuff. They said it. They're like, oh, I, like, I love hot stuff. And he's like, yeah, it's hot to me. So when, like, somebody that likes it hot says it's hot, you can count me out of that ordeal. Now, Bentley ate it. Also, owe uh, Bentley $5 because uh, they brought Bentley a, a piece of lemon on his sweet tea, you know, stuck to the glass. I said, you want to make $5 right now? Good morning. Oh, thank you, Miss Tracy Whistler with the super chat. Thank you, girl. Man, I was going to hit the like button on it. It won't let me. I said, you want to make. Steve and I enjoy watching you. 30th birthday for my daughter. Wow. Okay, Laura. Wow. Okay. Okay. So. Um, I said, you want to make $5 right now? He's like. Yeah. I said, eat that lemon. I said, the peeling and all. Man. He ate that thing like a piece of Laffy Taffy. Never, never missed a beat. Like, he made him $5 instantly. And he was talking to Brian. And Brian said, man, I can smell that lemon breath from him. <laughs> I mean, that joker, yeah, pay the, pay the man, I'm telling you, yeah. Yeah, man, the deer was incredible. We fed the deer off the balcony and like, everybody was trying to get Brian to be quiet because the deer was out there and Brian just, you'd have to meet Brian in person. Brian, he don't have a whispering bone in his body. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, he don't have a whispering bone in his body. He, everybody got on to him. I mean... He's a mess. Let me just tell you. He's a mess. 
we feeding the deer and everybody's whispering and like we finally got Brian to be quiet a minute. <laughs> I'm telling you. Now we sitting there on the back and the next thing and like we all laughed. Brian said, Well there you go. If that didn't scare him off on nothing will <laughs> I was like, I can't take him nowhere. <laughs> oh, gosh. You know, I spit my coffee. I'm telling you. We all being quiet, feeding the deer. And thunder rolls and lightning strikes. <laughs> Oh, man. Woo! Mm. Gotta love it. We sang karaoke, too. Oh, yeah. Brian, something else now. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, Brian was out there. Don't tell my heart, my achy breaky heart, I just don't think you'll understand. And if you tell my heart, I was like, hey, wait now, wait a minute. My achy, breaky heart, it might blow up and kill this man. Ooh. <laughs> it was like, next time you come down, we're putting you on the camera. Tell anyone you please. <laughs> man, he done started taking his shirt off. I was like, easy now. <laughs> He will work in it. Yeah. 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 I got a few videos. Uh, don't worry, Brian. I'm not going to show nobody. But I have a few videos. If he ever gets out of line, I can keep him in check. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. He's a mess now. <sighs> Brian said, I don't care. I don't imagine you do. <laughs> oh, man. You can't get Brian because he'll show me to him himself. Ain't <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good to see y'all, y'all. Beautiful day. I got to feed the animals. I got a, I got a show planned for y'all today. I was going to say, I don't think he would care. <laughs> oh, man, I'm telling you. <laughs> oh lord you know the saying like <sighs> we did we did it was it was good we didn't have no sugar for the coffee but we had a good time all right country diva have a good day girl thank you for tuning in Always good to see you. <laughs> oh, well. Wow. 
I have a two-year-old hen that'll help you chase your goats around. Penny, look. My goats is a mess. Wow. Hey, Carol, good to see you. Good to see you. <laughs> I love my sweet laugh. Oh, sometimes you get tickled now. So, uh, I found out about Cheryl, you know, Cheryl is very interesting, you know, Brian and Cheryl. So, uh, I found out Cheryl can make lots of animal sounds, just like me, like surprisingly good. I mean, like, spot on. I was like, they ain't no way. So, so I walked down the mountain. I don't know how far it was, y'all. Let me tell you about the mountains. I walked down, I don't know, quarter of a mile. Like, you, where we was at, where we was at, you could see a lake, like, off through the woods. And, um... Uh, so I was like, me and Bentley got the fishing poles ready, and we was like, you know, we're going to walk to that lake. But we had to walk down the mountain. And I'm saying down the mountain, down the mountain. There was nothing flat about it. Like, all my toenails were hurting from, like, being crammed in my shoe. So by the time I got down there, my toenails was hurting. That's something, like... I didn't even know it was a thing. <laughs> I mean, how does that happen, you know? But we got down there, finally. Finally got down there to the lake. Man, it was so beautiful. It was clear. We seen fish swimming. It was beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Like, we seen all kinds of... We didn't catch anything, but we also... Uh, we didn't take our tackle and stuff. So we was kind of using what was they had at the lodge there in like a lost and found. But we had a good time. But I was down in that valley. And I could hear them talking from the balcony. I called up Brian. I said, man, do you realize I can hear you from here? And he just busts out laughing. <laughs> I said, matter of fact, everybody... Within a half a mile can hear you. And then he laughs some more. <laughs> hey. How was the climb back up? It was very interesting. The climb back up was interesting. But. But I was on the. I was down there at the lake. You know and I. Oh. 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 Like I, I hoot out. And then I hear Cheryl answer me. I said, wow. So me and her had a hoot owl conversation. Because I can change, like, my hoot owl. And, and uh, I don't know. I was I got tickled. And then I started doing the crow call. Then she started answering me back. And I was like, man, that girl can do it. And I was, like, doing turkey call. Here she come. I was like, I didn't know that girl could do all that. It was about, like too bad I didn't have it on video. Because uh, they was zero service uh, down in that bottom. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> when you go off side them mountains, it's like, it's pretty rough. But yeah, we fished and, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank you for that. Thank you. <laughs> we had a good time though, and um, sure did. Climbing back up was climbing back up was better. That's bad to say, but it was easier to go up it than it was to come down it. I don't know. 
<laughs> but it was, I wish I'd know how far it was. Like, it was pretty, you walking kind of like, you walking leaned over like this. You don't realize you're walking leaned over, but you really are walking up the mountain leaning forward. That's the craziest thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Cheryl, can you do the elephant? She said, the elephant? I said, yeah. She said, I can't do no elephant now. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah hey melinda good to see you girl wow so we just got back we just got back and brian messaged me and said he was at the er uh <laughs> it will want it Beauty Granny said he went to the ER this morning and he asked me how I felt. I said, man, I feel fine. He said he's got the flu, test positive for the flu today. And I'm like, wow, man, I'm glad I didn't drink after you, you know. He warned me when we was there. He's like, look, see that milk in the refrigerator? I said, yeah. He said, I drank out of the jug. Just letting you know. He said, <laughs> he said, you welcome to some, but uh, I drank out of the jug just like you. I was like, yeah, well, uh, oh, thank you so much, Missy. Oh, that was sweet. Yeah, man, I, I hate he's sick, and I hope we don't get it. Uh, I hate he's got it. Wow. Brandon Jordan says she's 29 minutes from LJ. Girl, you could have met us and ate with us. Jeffrey said, I grew up in them mountains. Yeah, we was on Sleepy, Sleepy Hollow. Sleepy Willow. Sleepy Willow. I... But it's so funny because, um, Stephen, I was born in LJ. Oh, wow. I didn't know that. Wow. Okay. Okay. You fighting something off, too? Yeah. I feel good. I feel good. I feel refreshed. I'm telling you what. I stayed in that. They got a hot tub. I stayed in it. Brian's like, every time. I go missing, he got come to the hot tub, and I'm like, there I am. Oh, okay, start taking it, okay. You said vitamin, let's see. Start that vitamin C 1000 a day if you don't already take it. Okay, I can do that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Rio Rodriguez. Re, re go re, hey thank you for that thank you yes yes oh i yeah i got in the hot tub multiple times a day like i think poly creek plantation gonna have to have one i don't know how i'm gonna swing it but uh that was beautiful no you had a cold for three weeks. Wow. I don't know who it was. I think it was Cheryl got in there. <laughs> if y'all know about hot tubs, y'all know about this. <laughs> oh, Dawn said the hot tub looked beautiful. Yeah, I took pictures and put it on Snap in the hot tub. You can see the mountains in the background. Wow, it was it was so beautiful, so beautiful. I had my coffee in there. But uh, Cheryl got into hot tub with uh, 
I, I guess her shirt she had on didn't have all the soap out of it or something. <laughs> <laughs> it was like epic suds like suds everywhere suds running over onto the deck running down the handrail running into the yard I was like Like, it was pretty interesting. Now, I got to tell you, Brian, he only made me uncomfortable one time the whole trip. Okay? One time. I was, I was getting out of the jacuzzi, you know, and Brian said, Man, look at them back muscles. <laughs> I'm thinking, Brian, what do you say to that? Well, thank you. I mean, Lord, I mean, he's a character now. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with him. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. I mean, that's the first time in my life. That might have been the second time in my life. Uh, Cheryl cleaned the hot tub without even knowing it. <laughs> I told you. That was the second time. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you. Rego. Rego. Um, <laughs> um, that was the second time in my life. Did it? Did I like? Didn't know, really know what to say. You know, what do you say? <laughs> oh man, I'm telling me. Tell me. Woo. Good morning. Yeah. I think I'm gonna get me one more cup. Y'all want a cup of coffee? Great seeing you today. Thank you, Angela. Brian said, Day, they wasn't a dull moment. We had a blast. You got, hey, you, you got to, uh, Brian, you got to ask Adam what I told him. I told him something about you. Like, uh, I ain't going to say it on him, but I went down there. Like, I went down there to your room. I was going to tell you that the cookies was ready. <laughs> I just turned right around, and I just went on back upstairs. I didn't have the heart to knock on the door. But you can ask that. <laughs> you can ask that. <laughs> Oh, man. Like, just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. I 
No, now, don't take it wrong. Don't take it wrong. All I heard was Brian, and I just heard what he said, and I just, I like, almost, I hardly could make it. I hardly could make it to the balcony to laugh. There was no way I could laugh at the door. I held it, but I ran all the way, all the way to the balcony like I had to get out of there. <laughs> it's, the funniest, it's the funniest thing I heard the whole trip. <laughs> I told Adam, Adam sent about 10 crying faces. And then in like a minute later, he sent some more crying faces. And then a few minutes later, he sent some more crying faces. I was like, yeah, that's pretty good. What? <laughs> he got tickled about that. He got tickled about that a couple times. <laughs> you know what Brian says? I don't care. Tell it. I ain't doing it. <laughs> oh, man. You back? Well, you ain't, man, you done missed a whole bunch. Just made my morning. You need some coffee? Oh, I, come on, girl. I fixed Cheryl a cup of coffee. We was all sitting around drinking coffee. We was all sitting around drinking coffee, you know, the other morning. And I noticed Cheryl didn't have no coffee. I said, Cheryl, baby, where's your coffee? She said, I don't drink that hot mess. I like my cold coffee. I said, you like that rich girl coffee, don't you? She said, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> so I like went to the coffee pot. I, I poured some of the hot coffee in a cup, and I, I got some ice out of the freezer, and I filled it up. Uh, now, it took a minute because it was melting. But I filled it up with ice and I poured some creamer in it, stirred it up. Now, we didn't have no sugar, you know. but uh, So I took her a cold coffee to her. She said, you made that for me? I said, yeah, I knew Brian wasn't going to do it. <laughs> he said, he said, easy now. <laughs> but yeah she drank it she said you know that's i said it ain't starbucks but like it's cold she uh she said it was good she drank it <laughs> we had a good time <laughs> oh man Man, the deer, we well, you know we didn't see any bears, but I know they're there. Um, we didn't see any bears. You know, Cheryl is, I don't, I don't guess, I don't guess, you mind if I brag on Cheryl, do you, Brian? Cheryl is the game warden. She's like, Cheryl is like, the only time I get in trouble in my life is from like what she is. Fishing game. <laughs> uh, and she told me when we was going down there in that lake, she's like, y'all be careful. We're really careful. I was like, I'm going to be careful. She said, just watch your surroundings. I said, well, if you hear me, down there, then you know it, it. It wasn't very good for the for them. Like, 
Yeah, that's right. Yeah, she works for DNR. I know, Brian. I didn't want to say a whole lot. We, I mean, I'm already jealous, okay? Brian got that good woman making that good money. And she's sweet. Mm-hmm. That girl can cook now. What's going on, Teresa? Hey, that girl can cook. She cooked. She cooked a barbecue chicken. And I, I got to tell you this. You got your license. <laughs> I like, I always have my license. I bought a sportsman that covers everything. And I got it on automatic renewal. That way, I don't get in trouble. But, um... <laughs> yeah but we had a good time we had a good time it was it was bentley's like bentley wanted to stay longer i was like look if you if you didn't have school we would where did you go Hey, we went to we went to L J. What's going on, Tony Z? Good to see you, brother. Brenda, Leanne, Michelle, Carol, Adam, Dawn, all the angels. All the angels is in there. What does D N R stand for? Uh, department. Division, a natural. You know what? I don't know. We just know you run when you see them. Resources. Yeah. Yeah. Department of Natural Resources. Seems like they'd make another name. Department of Natural... Hey, you know... uh, Yeah, there you go. Brian told us. Now, Brian, now, Adam... You know, Adam's on here. You know, he went with us. That's a cool dude. Telling you right now. <laughs> that joker can sing, too, now. He's like me. Horse races. <laughs> Adam's like me. When he sings, he closes his eyes. And anybody you ever seen that close their eyes when they sing, they feel it. They feel the music. That joke can sing now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good morning, good morning. Good, good morning. They into it. Yep. Yep. Y'all, I hate a Mr. Concert. Uh, I'll be making it up to y'all. Um, so, so the re you know, I, I originally planned on doing the concert Thursday. But there was so much, like, running around trying to get everything done to... Um, you know, I had to get all my running around done. I had to get my fences seen about. I had to get my animals seen about. Like, I'm telling you, like, I had so much going on that it just cut me so close to time. And I called Daddy. I was like, look, man, like, I can sing. I mean, I said, I can sing. I said, but I don't think I'd be worth a crap. Friday to be here to drive up there, like, and daddy's like, yeah, sang white boy blues, <laughs> is that what you were singing, I, you know, you sung a song in there at the pool table, I ain't never heard, but I tell you, you sang the fire out of it, I ain't never heard it, if you remember what song it is, send it to me in the message where I can listen to it. But yeah, uh, 
let's see here. Yeah, but I forgot what I was even saying. What was I saying? Mm. Oh, the concert. I told Daddy. I said, I said, man, I don't, I don't believe, I believe if I sing, I said, I'm going to be too tired. I think, I think it'll like mess my trip up, like getting there. Because when I sing on Friday nights, you know, I, I kind of lay around Saturday. I don't know till sometimes two o'clock. And then I get up and then I usually do, um, I usually do some videos for y'all that night. But, but everybody was, you know, I seen a lot of comments about you, you know, you needed to break, you need to get away, you, you was overwhelmed, like, I'm not overwhelmed, like, I am good, I'm good, I was good then, um, like, this, this don't get to me, um, I, I enjoy doing this, 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 I get so much out of doing this for y'all. The love that I get, the, the compassion, the dedication, the sweet comments, the little gifts, the hearts, the likes. Wow. You know, y'all complete me. And I know y'all say like, you know, thank you for doing this. Like, we need you. I, like, I need y'all. So this is, there's no I in team. We do this together, and together this makes us stronger. So yeah, so so I need y'all. Like when I say it feels good to be loved, it feels good to be loved. It that just ain't a trademark. That's truly how I feel, and I can say, I can say for without a shadow of a doubt, without a shadow of a doubt, I feel loved, and y'all. Are beautiful. We need you. Well, I need y'all. I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> I ain't going nowhere. I'll be here. <laughs> we better together. That's right. <sighs> yeah, we are better together. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow thank you i ain't seen the bike that's pretty cool yeah 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 i had a great time great time love man little man played pool Let me just tell you, he played pool so much. Teamwork makes dream work. It does, don't it? I said, friend, don't make no one and only love I ever need. Hey, Keegan, now. Nah. Friends, don't take her. I don't know if you understand. I mean, I know y'all women don't know, but like, yeah, when you get a mustache and it gets too long, this bothers you. Yeah, there it is. I found my lip again. I got to trim this. And I know last week y'all said, oh, wow, your trim looks so good. I never trimmed it. <laughs> I never trimmed it. I never got a chance to. So when that hair on your lip gets too long, it's aggravating. But I do got to trim a little bit. I just never got around to it. And I got something. I got a gift right here. Can you get me a husband? <sighs> mm. 
well then. What do we got right here? Oh, wow. Are you kidding? Um, Thelma, are you in here, girl? Just keep swimming. <laughs> yeah, I ain't, I ain't no matchmaker. I mean, I've helped some people out, you know. That has to be Bentley's. Just keep swimming. <laughs> so let's see. Get this open. Sorry, I'm struggling. So this is beautiful, look. Wow, yeah, this is mine. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful. Wow. Services needed in layaway. I'm trying. Y'all said I'm good at everything. Well, you about to see something I ain't good at. Come on, baby. Work right now. Got it. Get it. Yeah, get it, get it. That's hard right there. Telling you what. I mean, just this right here ain't easy. Tell you the truth. Just get on there. You can do it. <laughs> I mean, help me. what it is y'all focus i will get it you know i know a lot i almost need to close my eyes i don't know why closing your eyes helps a little bit yeah let me take a break on that one before i get burned out Feel through it. <laughs> Come on. 
You almost had it. You almost had it. Yeah. You almost had it. There's a little dollar. Come on. <laughs> I, was, I was struggling on a whole nother level. Come on. Huh? Come on. Paul in there. Oh, I was catching a cramp. I'm glad I got it. I was catching a cramp. I got it. Stick your tongue out. That seems to help too, don't it? <laughs> Hey, it's going pretty good, Lee. Appreciate you for asking. Yeah. It's going rather, rather well. What going on? <laughs> you have to stick your tongue out <laughs> to the other side <laughs> to get it. <laughs> Just wait till them thumbs quit working. Oh, man. <sighs> Lord, that was like... This little man's, he'll love it. I'll make sure he gets this. He will absolutely love that. I'll make sure he gets that. <clears throat> 10 06. Wow. I don't think there's one day in my life I'm on time for my shows. It's a good thing y'all love me, because if you, like, depended on me to come on live, if you, like, sitting around at a certain time, I'm sorry. I try. I try my best. Like, Cheryl heard you make lots of animal sounds. <laughs> Cheryl, I was spilling the tea about you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I was. Do you know how good the tea, the tea, do you know how good the coffee is this morning? Do you know how good the coffee is this morning that I got sugar in it? What's, we got a problem here. Sylvia's spelling and bringing it. What's going on, girl? What happened to working on the house? It's called, this is the Stephen Hodges show. And we do what Stephen Hodges is doing. We just keeping on swimming. Holla at you. <laughs> Holla at you. Stephen, do you have a P.O. box number? I sure do, girl. Um, 
It's in the description. It's not in the description. It's be some one of my moderators put it in chat. It's Stephen Hodges P.O. Box fourteen o o one East Dublin, Georgia three one zero two seven. There you go. There you go. There it is. Ask Bearded Granny and she playing around. Man, that's something. <laughs> Say hello, making red velvet cream cheese cookies. Girl, are you kidding? Why you gotta do me like that? You know, I ain't ate breakfast yet. Why can't people just be nice? I'm seriously don't cost a penny to be nice. You know why? Because it's it's so much easier to be mean than it is nice. You actually you actually have to work to be nice. But mean that comes out like this. So you know you just you don't take it personal and you pray for them people. You know, I don't let negativity affect me you know it's their it's their right you know it's their right to be that way you know oh my goodness you ever have a lifesaver gummies i'm gonna tell you right now you don't want any mm. They ain't no way you would like these. <clears throat> wow, these are fresh. Got an X's and O's. Those are my favorite candy. I know. Somebody says, it looks like you got a Walgreens counter behind you. You know what? This is from two women. Look. Two ladies sent all this. I looked at the box when it came. It had $32 for shipping. I was like, woo. Could you imagine that? That's a care package right there now. Nothing says I love you like, let me spend $100 between candy and shipping to get it to you. I will share it with you. You can have anything back here. <laughs> Tony Z, I thought about you, man. I was driving. I don't even know where the place was. Brian and Brian or Adam might know. But we was driving and in LJ, in between the cabin and Walmart, they had the biggest, and I mean the biggest, American flag blind I have ever seen. It looked like it was the size of my house. Like it was so big that it was flapping. But it was so big, it's like it was flapping like. Got it. It was so big, it was flapping majestically, if that makes sense. I, I don't know, but it, it it's like it had multiple waves in it. It was huge. Man, that, it, I can't imagine how much, I can't imagine how heavy that would be, but it was beautiful. I almost needed to pull over a minute. I guarantee you, Adam, Adam probably knows. I think he works around there, but uh, man, that was beautiful. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
<laughs> you should get one for your yard. I got two. I got one in my yard on a flagpole, man. Yeah, you'll see it today. A heart on keeps a hand on I was so sure what I needed was more. Mm. Mm. That was good. <sighs> you know, it rained. We had a three hour. We had a three hour and thirty minute drive. Okay. And it rained the whole entire way up there. I'm gonna be trimming this soon. Um you're a big kid. Yeah, I am. And just know when I jump in your lap, I'm a lot. Um, so, I forgot what I was saying again. You ever do that? Y'all ever ride in the middle of telling something and forget? Oh, the rain. There it is. It came back to me. <laughs> Woo! So, it rained the whole entire time up there. And I did not see one wreck the whole entire way. That was unbelievable. And I mean, I'm telling you, It, it rained like horribly bad. There was water. Uh, I got in the express lane. You know, I didn't know how easy the express lane was. You know? Somebody told me, hey, you can get a you can get a peach pass and preload uh preload like stuff on it. You can preload money on it and drive in the Peach Pass lane. That's like where you buy yourself. I was like, what? Yeah. Yeah. Like, you mean I can drive over there by myself? I can drive by myself. <clears throat> uh, let's see. And like, all they gonna do is just send me like a $15 ticket in the mail because I didn't have a peach patch. That's a bargain. I drove it all the way there. So, like, I'm going to be waiting on to get the $15 ticket in the mail. That was so worth it. You know how I many people we passed uh, being in the express lane? Like, in even one time, five lanes of traffic was at a dead steal. I was running 86, clicking it on back. I was like, that's so worth $15. So, like, I was kind of mad, you know, on the way back home because they had it closed off. I was wanting to do it again. I saved $15. So, they're having the express lane closed. Uh, I saved $15 coming home because I... <laughs> we 
Woo, I would have I would have definitely done it coming back home. That was winning. But I tell you, when I drove when we drove back home, it was bad. Okay. So when we hit Atlanta, traffic. I drove 35 miles an hour for an hour. For an hour. That's winning. How do you drive 35 miles an hour for an hour? That was like 1 o'clock. One o'clock Sunday. Traffic was horrible. I'm telling you right now. Horrible. Everybody getting out of church. Everybody going to the buffet. <laughs> yeah. Ah. <yeah. laughs> uh. Yeah, we made it back winning. Show sure did. Thank you, Missy, Mary, Sandy. Thank y'all. And uh, Revo93, thank you so much. Let's see. Going to edit that now. Going to change that. I'm going to get it off that heart. What the, what the world going on here? What the world is going on here? Yes. Yeah. Another minute. <sighs> Woo! You don't talk about feeling brand new. Wow, that's so long. Yeah, I can see why that bothered me now. You ever seen somebody that hair bothers them? Me. Hair. What about when it's back there? I can't do it. When it gets back there, I can't do it. When it's hung. <laughs> The best way to get it out is gargle with some water. <laughs> yeah. So I was, I was trying to wait on my phone to charge. I, I, I was tired last night. I was tired last night and I uh, I didn't even charge my phone nor my tablet. Like, you ever done that before? Like, I had good intentions, but I passed out. Yes, it bothers the tater farmer, too. <laughs> A piece of buttered bread to help push it down the hatch. Oh, look at Miss Shirley Nash. Thank you, girl. Believe it or not, Miss Shirley, but I was thinking about you this weekend, too. Ain't that, ain't that funny how that is? Ain't that funny? 
You know how many Corvettes I seen on the road? Wow, I seen so many Corvettes. Little man was like, Dad, look at that Ferrari. I was like, no, baby, that's just a new Corvette. So I thought about you owning your five Corvettes. Um, I'm a little jealous, just saying. Um, but, uh, yeah, I thought about you. I don't know why, but you the first thing I thought about when I kept seeing them Corvettes. We've seen Porsches. We seen a Porsche with a tag on the back that said Dr. 5 -O. I was like, well then, tell us what you do for a living. <laughs> that's funny. I don't drive mine in bad weather. I know that's right. I know that's right. Yeah. She said, I don't drive mine in bad weather. <laughs> You know what? You know what else I thought about? My truck sitting over there tore up. I still ain't looked at it. I ain't looked at it. I ain't had time. My son on the Porsche, my daddy bought it for him. Wow. How about that? Wow. So I need to. So I bought me a tripod. Can y'all believe it? Oh, my gold, my gold Ford's tore up. I hadn't looked at it. I actually, I had a 68 Camaro. Look out now. So I bought a tripod that holds my tablet. Yeah. Yeah. So like I broke down and I got me another big old light. I got me another bring light. You know, I broke my hood. And it, we was just like this and it went out like. I tapped it. I was like. And I threw it over there. So I bought another one. I broke down and bought another one. You know. It's hard, you know. My uncle owns a Corvette shop called the Corvette Doctor. Man, I wish I need to get my car to him. <laughs> What's going on? Jody says I had a 68 Camaro too. That's that's mm, mm. you see any electric vehicles getting towed. Um No, I just see them sitting at the gas station. Plugged up. I don't want an electric one. I want, I want to hear the motor. I want to hear sound when you get on it. I want to hear passing gear. I want to spin a wheel. <laughs> Woo. I had a 65 Chevelle Malibu. Bearded Granny, I don't doubt that a bit. Not a bit. You know what I didn't think about? I got to go out here and feed the animals. I didn't think about I need a mother tripod. So I bought a tripod for my for this too for y'all. Except it sits on the ground. So I had a. Pinto once. Ain't nothing wrong with a Pinto. You just had to pop the clutch with that thing. Rev it up to the limit. But don't dump the clutch on the first time you let it up to the limit. Because when it hits the rev limiter, it'll drop down. You dump the clutch the second time it goes to the rev limit. That's a rule. Everybody knows that. First time, it's like, hand, hand, hand. <laughs> Woo. You ever heard them? And then you got to time it. 
and the second time it comes up, just I mean, like, and if you don't change gears like that, you need to ride with me. It matters. You have to drive it aggressive. If you don't drive it aggressive, you ain't getting your money's worth. I had a 1100 Yamaha V-Star Cruiser. You little wild thing. I knew you was fun. Yeah, I ain't never met you, but that's funny because Brian was talking about you this weekend. He's like, you know what? I, I'd love to meet, uh, I'd love to meet Brian. I, I'd love to meet, uh, Beardy Granny now. I was like, yeah, me too. We'd all go to jail. I believe it, you know? <laughs> well, I'm telling you what, we'd eat good. And, uh, Ashley, Ashley, I've been looking for you, girl. Let me tell you, the last video I done. I got two dough dashes. Bearded Granny said, yeah, we would. In no particular order either. <laughs> so let me tell you, I had a, a milkshake, onion rings, double cheese, which I ate. Uh, I mean, y'all didn't see me eat the cheeseburger live. But once I ended my live, I went up there to that other plate. Because it was two plates. I was like, what in the world is that? Um, uh, yeah, we wouldn't go to jail hungry anyhow. <laughs> America, you know? Uh, so I went up there. You know, I was already off the show, but I've worked. I still worked a pretty good while, um, you know, after I ended my life. But, uh, I took all that stuff to the landfill, which is about 35 minutes from here. Um. We all will get new bracelets. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, um, I opened that plate up, and it was, it was a hamburger and wings. Okay, I don't even know where you got that from, but I ate all the wings. I took the hamburger part. I ate the meat. Sorry, I'm a meat eater. I like it a lot, but. And then I got that down, and I opened the second plate. I'm like, what's in here? Oh, oh, a Philly cheese steak. I ate it. I'm telling you right now. I ate all three plates. I didn't even know I was hungry. I drank the Kool-Aid, which was good, by the way. Thank you. And I drank the Sprite. And I drank the Coke. I ate three plates. Like, I don't. So it did not go to waste. So I appreciate it. You know? I ate it all. I didn't intend to eat it all. It just happened. It was good. Look. Gotta maintain it, you know? Wait a second. You gotta maintain it. So I maintained it. Oh, that milkshake was good. I was hungry. I didn't even realize it. Man, them wings were good, too. I'm telling you. I don't even know where that came from. I didn't recognize the package. You know, I didn't eat it. Uh, American Deli. Oh, whoa, I ain't been there. I ain't been there in a long time. I, wow, that was a good Philly. I'm telling you. Did y'all miss that about me? <laughs> I can't help it. You know, I don't want to go live and burp, but you know what? It happens. We was all worried about our Superman. Man, you ain't got to worry about me. I'm good. I'm good. And despite what everybody thinks, I don't have depression. I'm not hiding anything. <laughs> I might be hiding something. But it ain't depressed. I'm good. I am the least 
depressed person in the world. Like, I don't like getting on hand doing that, but it happens, you know? And, like, I'm sorry. I've even watched one of my videos back, and I was like, man, that's ridiculous. Like, I got on my own nerves watching me do that. But I can't help, like, look, I got next. See, I'm right-handed, I take. Only thing I take. Well, I, I did take something. I was taking something else, but I couldn't sleep. Yeah. I had to quit. It's test booster max. <laughs> I had to quit. I had to get off that. Uh, I only took like. Yeah, it's still full. I only took like five days worth, and it got to where I couldn't even sleep. <laughs> I couldn't sleep. I was like, what's wrong with me? But why? I'm not even doing anything. I mean... I promise I didn't do it. You know? American Daily. Oh, well, that was beautiful. I'd definitely be going back here. I liked it. It was good. I need that shirt. <laughs> I didn't do nothing. <laughs> Look. We got to go feed the animals. Y'all ready? Let's see. I got a beautiful, sh uh, beautiful shirt. I got a beautiful program today for y'all on my 10 o'clock, which we a little late. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little bit late. Yeah. So, um. Stephen, tell them you're practicing for the National Belching Contest. Lord, that ain't even fun to talk about. I'm sorry, y'all. I'll do, but I'll try to do better, but. Uh, I'll try to do better about that. What's going on, Mark? Good to see you, brother. Yeah, I got to get out here and feed the babies. And um, I got a beautiful program today for y'all at 10 o'clock. <laughs> probably going to be 11 by now, but uh, I got to go check their water and feed. Um, I usually change their waters out on Fridays, so I need to make sure their water's clean. And uh, I don't go out there ahead of time and look. So what you see is real time. So, you know. They're weirder. Yeah, they're weirder. I, that's the way I like to say it. You know, you know, people like country folks, we have our own language. Yeah. Yeah, weirder is one of Let me uh, let me change my shoes because I don't want to go out there now. My uncle used to say, bring it up again and we'll vote on it. <laughs> yeah, she said uh she said that uh No, it was Thelma. So so yeah, we want to know about Dawn's son and we all know about Thelma's son. Thelma said her son moved in with a woman. Which is a good thing. <laughs> I don't know why I thought about that, but could be worse. Uh yeah. 
So good thing, you know. Maybe he needs a good woman to keep him on the right path. Slap him around a little bit if he needs it. You know, we don't all need that, but some of us do. You know, some of us need to be whipped up in shape. And I ain't one. You know, I don't too much, you know, I don't really need no home training. I, I come, I come already ready to go. Oh, wow. Her, her little man's still sick. Wow. Wow, I hate to hear that. Bless his heart, he's been sick for two weeks. Well, thank you, thank you. There's somebody out there right now. Somebody out there right now saying, yeah, I'd keep him in check. <sighs> Let me change my shoes and we go outside. <laughs> <laughs> you need a man with a slow pain. You need a man with a feel. You need someone that understands. Come and go in a heat and rush. Everybody was kung fu fighting. Those cats was fast as lightning. How in the world do you make a mess this big? I don't know what happened, but my totes that I had stacked up over here turned over into the floor. How does this even happen? Come and go in a heated rush. Is somebody that understands? How did all my stuff dump over into the floor? There's no way to make this up. All my storage bins dumped out on the floor. Little understands won't come out of heat it raw. That's exactly why I don't put no shoes on without chicken. be putting a shoe on I ain't worn a while without checking that bad breath for out. Hold on. I'm trying. What's going on? Dem's boots. Dem's boots. <sighs> like, they done been in the clay. Won't be the last time neither. All right, let me get uh, let me get my stuff together. We finna go out. Check on everybody. 
common gold and a heated brush. Need somebody that understands his little hand. Get it out of the way right quick before I get started. Sorry, I'm about to be done giving y'all whiplash. I made everybody throw up. See about everybody. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see. If you working with me, you better start getting up at three o'clock practicing. <laughs> Lord now. I be got fired from my own job. Yeah, let's go see about this baby. Let me kick the tripod though. That's what I like to do. That's what I like to do on my spare time kick the tripod. You having the time of your life? It's the only way I'd have it right here. What going on today? What going on? What are y'all doing? I'm coming. Hold on, I'm coming. Daddy coming. Daddy coming. <laughs> yeah. Give me a second, I'm struggling. I ain't never had it whoop, but it's getting whoop right now. <laughs> Bear with me a moment. Technical difficulties. Coming on in here, baby. Yeah. <laughs> That's your my baby goat. That's your my baby goat. Yeah. That's your my baby goat. That's your my baby goat. What's going on, baby goat? What's going on, mama goat? Hey, don't don't do it. Don't do it, Captain. <laughs> Don't do it, Mama. Her's gonna knock my tripod over. That's your my baby go. Y'all doing good? Everybody doing good? What's going on? What's going on? You doing good? You doing good, buddy? Yeah, yeah. Y'all looking good. <laughs> you want to talk about a little spunky monkey now? Look at here now. Tell them how you feeling, man. What going on? Say, your dad, you're my baby daddy. That's your my baby daddy. Tell him. That's your my baby daddy. <laughs> yeah, that's... 
That's a cute man, ain't it? That yours? That yours, my baby daddy. What? What? Tell him. Tell him. Tell him how it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna we're gonna not do that for a minute. All right, uh, let me get uh, let me go get my brush because I gotta I gotta clean their water. So, <laughs> dang girl, <laughs> I just seen her look. I just seen her drop an egg out. I seen it. I seen it when it fell out. Bless your heart. It come out. It come out point down. Woo. Woo. Girl, you need you a minute, don't you? Seen her standing up like I was like, what is she doing? And then it was like, Ooh. oh, oh, it's magic, you know. What it is? Look. I got to go get the brush. I'll be right back. You know, I did stand there a little slide up. But I don't know, the baby likes, the baby likes laying in that corner of the slide. So, uh, I just left it turned over like that. Because I, I come out here, I come out here and they like laying in that corner of it. I don't know, I guess it's like feels safe or something. But anyhow, let me go get the brush. I'll be right back. Come and go in a heated rush From that Honda stand I'll be right back. Don't do anything illegal. Coming, baby. That your my baby goat. That your my baby goat. So I got to brush. Uh, I got to brush the water. 
dirty. I usually I do this once a week. You know, people told me I could put a uh, little vinegar in it. But... Don't knock it down, baby. Easy! Girl. Easy over there on it. as warm as it can be. <laughs> Already, you know. Be patient with me, y'all. I'm trying. You a good mama, baby. You a good mama. Yeah. You did good. 
You did good. <laughs> Come and go, Elmo. Eat it, bro. Life has just begun. Lay a weary head to rest. Don't you cry no more. <sighs> you know, I put a. So, I put Sparrow, sorry y'all, I'm trying. So I put Sparrow in here, where he could lay beside Mama and the baby, you know. This, this, this Jack Sparrow right here. Dobby's over here, so, uh, so I put him in there for about a week, but, now I'm gonna put him back in here with Dobby and let them play a little bit. Uh, let them have some bro time. But uh, let me keep on going, moving right along. I tell you what, was he was rough to catch. Uh, having him out by himself, he was rough. And I mean rough catching. By itself. You ready, Judon? <laughs> Come and go in a heated rush. Someone that understands. Come love him. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How do you like me now? Now that I'm on my way. So they can get this some they can get this some bro time in. They best friends. They the Rick and the Bobby. They like Brian and Adam.
How do you like me now? Now that I'm on my way, you crazy standing here today. Side your radio is all I dream about. How do you like me now? Gonna lie to you, that there. Something in there smells like. Something in there smells like fish. That's a big negative. That's rough. Woo! Somebody's duty box is working. Yeah!
Johnny Cash showing out. What's going on, Johnny Cash? Look at him showing out. Done, showing out. You done walked out of camera frame, man. Woo. Funniest thing. Funniest thing ever. You know, we was up there at the mountains, you know. Woo! We was up there at the mountains. Adam got a business call, okay? And, uh... He went outside on the back deck, you know, to take the call. And I don't know why, I walked out there to myself. He was like, yes, sir, you know, I'm on vacation this week. Uh, i tell you what, when I get in, I, I'll call you Monday and we'll get it scheduled. Well, here come Brian, you know, here come Brian. He's on the phone, Brian, like Adam's on the phone. Brian walks up behind and grabs him on the wind the hips. And when I tell you he was, he's knocking the breath out of him from behind. Why? <laughs> Adam was trying to get away and he wouldn't let him go. <laughs> I got so tickled. <laughs> I got so tickled because Brian was trying to talk, but every time he'd go to say something, the air would get knocked out of him and the word didn't come out. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think he's gonna let him go, you know. Uh. 
<laughs> I was like, <laughs> woo, woo, you know? He said, man, I'm on a phone call. He said, Ann? <laughs> <laughs> he said, sir, I, he said, I apologize. He says, my friend has a crayon too short to see it. <laughs> like it was a work call. So you can imagine staying the weekend with him. From then on out, I always sit facing the door and I always sit in the corner with my, I never have my back exposed if you follow me. So I kind of did like y'all women folks do. I sit where y'all can see the door and you see who comes in, who leaves. From that point on, I never turned my back on Brian. <laughs> I can't make that up. Now, Mama told me. Mama told me when I was young, don't sit beside me, my only son, and listen closely to what I say. And if you do this, it'll help you some sunny day. Back, man. We don't want to be in here. But y'all some y'all some mess making champs. Hey, get you some ducks, you know? Get you some ducks.
Mama said these geese right here. Uh, Mama said these geese was biting her. You got the whole meal deal today, son. Yeah. I'm coming, y'all. Hold on a minute. I'm trying to get this mess cleaned up. Go, baby. Go. 
Lord, y'all knocked the hose out of the pool. I can't, what in the world? Going on here? I got it in my mouth. Help me. I got it in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all got the hose knocked out again. Thank <laughs> you. 
easy, tiger. Hold on a minute, son. Feels good to be loved. All I can say. Woo! Get your little self back in here. You know what that means, don't you? Spend the majority of the time setting up for the ride. It's warm in these rhinos. Woo. Uh, I see June. I've been looking for her. She's on top of the building. What's going on here? Really trapped, ain't you? 
Aren't you, baby? snips there's a fish basket she done went in i guess to get away from all them roosters i reckon why are you so crooked Hanging on like a champ, ain't you? Man, I'm glad I seen her back here. She was trapped. That would have been horrible. Pretty good. Ah, yeah. 
It's warm today. Let's see what the temperature is. 69 <laughs> degrees. I can't make that up. Woo! We almost there. We almost there. <laughs> Duty convention. It's all over me. Gotta love it. <laughs> Woo! Everybody feels good, don't they? Everybody feels good. They just crowing a little self off, ain't they? Just crowing a little self away, ain't they? Oh, I didn't miss some super chats. I appreciate the super chats. Uh, oh, and then met the gold. Let's see him. I didn't miss that too. Time, time flies when you're having fun, huh? Uh, I want to thank y'all. Let's see, Missy, Mary, Martin, Leanne. Woo! Thank y'all for meeting the gold for this for this morning. Let me go on and give y'all some more. What going on? Uh. Yeah. yeah, that's how I feel too. Boogie! Boogie! <laughs> they having them a good time, eh? All right. All right. Y'all enjoy y'all's day, and as always, thank you for flying with Delta. It's been my pleasure. Uh, woo. Woo. I finally know what it feels like to be James Brown in his concert. in it, baby. Yeah. <laughs> this is the pen where there's like, uh, there's a Mac daddy in here who wants to try you. I'm coming. Don't worry. Daddy's on the way. <laughs> we are all your wishes and dreams to come true. I'm coming. You the one, ain't you? Okay? You won't stay the chance. You stay over there. I have no problem putting you in daddy day camp. At all. I will clear my schedule for you.
fan. Like clean up day always takes a little longer than regular. Clean up do usually takes a little longer. Whew. Whew. Hi, dog, I'm late for my show, sure enough. Don't worry, we having it, we having it. Just take a little longer than I thought to get all my stuff, my rounds done. You ever feel like just wiping, you need to wipe your mouth, but I can't. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. So today I got a show planned. Yes. You like my shirt? I appreciate it. What breed is your best layers? I got uh, some Bluff Orphantons. Buff Orphantons. They some, they some egg laying rascals, I'm telling you right now. I bought me a beefed up tripod. It's got some big old legs. Big old legs. Love your shirt. Well, thank you, girl. Thank you, I got it on sale. I got it on sale. I must have lazy orphans. You don't have a doo doo remover, you should get one. I mean, I know it's still a camper, but nobody want to walk in there and see a loaf laying on the floor. Ask me, did rounds take a minute? Uh, yeah. 
Thank you. So what I'm doing, oh, this is what I bought. Tripod. I bought a big one. Except I bought this and I bought an attachment, a 12 inch attachment that screws onto this for my tablet. So, you know, I didn't even, I didn't even actually open this cause my tablet won't fit in there, but I bought this and a big bracket. Working like a champ. Duty convention. <laughs> Woo! Well, uh, let me let me go here, y'all. Thank you for watching Coffee with Stephen Hodges. I love all y'all. Don't never forget that. I, I ain't going nowhere. I just, you know, me and little man went took us a little vacation. We went out with good friends and. Enjoyed ourselves. Uh, had a good time. Felt refreshed, uh, renewed. Like I, uh, I so wanted to go live, but you know, uh, cause I missed y'all so much, and uh, you know, but I'm back. I'm back, and I got a and I got a beautiful program for y'all today. Even though I'm two hours late. Well, I'm an hour and 40, uh, I'm an hour and 50, yeah, a pretty good bit late, but anyway, um, uh, mm, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about, don't miss, don't miss the show on Stephen Hodges, I'm fitting to, I got my stuff charging right here, I'm, uh, I'm fitting to get my stuff it together, I gotta go out here and pump up my tires, but I love y'all, and I'll see y'all in about 15 minutes or so, whatever long it takes me to get together. Love y'all. Bye-bye. <laughs> yes.